Hi Year 3, welcome back, Mrs Powell here. Thanks to everyone who sent me their wonderful uh, dinosaur pictures last week, they were fantastic. So we're still keeping to the dinosaur theme this week and we're going to be drawing a fossil, but a fossilised fish. So let me show you how it's done. Well, I'm going to start my uh, fossilised fish drawing by drawing in the backbone, which consists of three um, quite narrow bones. Don't make the bones too straight, have a little bit of a sort of wiggle to them. And once you've done that, you're going to go to this end and draw the tail bones. Now the tail bones are, are very thin bones like this, okay, sort of fanning out into a tail shape. Okay, then you're going to go to this end and draw the head. So the first uh, bone is like a kind of crescent moon shape. I'll show you. So it's going to sort of curve around like that to form the, the back of the head. Then we're going to do the eye socket. So that's going to consist of a couple of smaller bones that curve round and then another one like this which is also in a sort of crescent moon shape. Then you can draw the front and then the mouth are bones like that. Now you're ready to fill in the rest of your fossilised fish with the, um, the sort of ribs, the skeleton and they're quite narrow. I'll speed it up so you can see what I'm doing. the drawing part of my fossilised fish. Now I'm going to add tone to each of the bones using a graphite pencil and then outline the entire drawing with a thin black permanent marker. So I'm just finishing off with a bit of tone and as you can see I've outlined the um, entire drawing also. Now to make it look as if it's a, a really old fossil found in a rock what I've got here is some um, coffee mixed with quite a lot of water and I'm just going to use it to stain the drawing. You could actually use tea as well. But let me see, there we go. So because I've used a permanent marker, the, uh, the pen isn't going to run. I'm just going to cover the whole thing with the coffee paint. So here's my finished fossilised fish picture. Now if you uh, finish your work, please do remember to put it into your distance learning slides and then tag me in so I can comment on your work. So good luck and keep drawing.